Resource Centre at East Burgart High School. I'm Jake and I'm one of the student librarians. Our school, LRC, contains over 10,000 fiction and non-fiction books that help us support our learning and reading for pleasure. Most of the fiction books in the LRC are purchased on the basis of a student recommendation. So if there is something you fancy reading, just let one of our librarians know. If we don't have it here, we will get it in for you. All students can take four books out for two weeks. Please return and renew to make sure that they are not overdue and that other students have the chance to read them. The library is open break and lunchtime throughout the school week. You can read, take books out, look at magazines and newspapers, complete and print homework and relax. The library is also open for late study sessions on Tuesday and Thursday evening until 4.45. This is a great chance to complete homework and extra study and this is supported by at least two members of staff who are on hand to help. The, the school run late buses to make sure that you can get home. You will also get the chance to come into the LRC each fortnight for a timetable reading lesson with you throughout evening. I find the library is a relaxing place, it's a good place to get books and if you just want to read, you can just come here, sit down, have a read and then the lessons where then your spag lessons where which you have once a week usually you can one of them spend a here in the library where you can just sit down and read. I like the library because it's quite a nice place to um, go into new worlds in books and things like that along with um, and it's quite a nice place to hang out and just um, sit down and relax for a bit if you want to. I like the library because it's a very comfortable place you can come with your friends. You can do your homework, read your favourite book or just have a chill out. Geographically uh, yeah. and metaphorically, it's the heart of the school. There's a book for every student here and there will always be something you'll be interested in. Part of the um, library um, team and um, we're here to um, just help you with um, anything you need in the library and um, stack books and do what we usually do. This is the fiction section of the library. We have all of the books in alphabetical order so that it's easy to find by the author's last name. For example, Robert Muchmore is in the M. This is the non-fiction section of the library. You can find many books on geography, history and everyday life. They are all in numerical order and each book has a unique number which relates to its subject. You can find the number on the spine of the book and then find the number in the subject index in the library. But this isn't just a library and a room with books. Across the year, the LRC organises lots of literacy events for the whole school. Hi there, I'm Mrs Pulse. I'm one of the two librarians here along with Mrs Norman. Book Mastermind competition is a competition open to the whole school. After choosing your favourite book, you are challenged to answer as many questions correctly as you can in two minutes in an exciting, fast-paced live competition. Readathon is a whole school reading event to raise money for children's charities. Each year, the students set themselves personal challenges in exchange for sponsorship money. Some students read Harry Potter over five weeks. Some students challenge themselves to read newspapers daily, and some pick their teacher's favourite book to read from start to finish, which is a great achievement for them. Over the years, we've raised over £6,000 for children's charities. World Book Day is celebrated by our school every year. All staff and students are encouraged to come in dressed as their favourite book characters and we have our very own World Book Day Oscars which are awarded to each of the best characters in each category. We also have lots of fun activities which are book themed on the day and we raise money for charity as well. Annually our six main feeder primary schools are invited to shadow the Cape Greenaway medals with us. The Cape Greenaway medal is awarded each year to the very best in children's illustrative fiction picture books. Each of the schools are given a set of the six shortlisted titles each year before they come together in our school to discuss their ideas and vote for their favourites. It's a fantastic opportunity to talk about books and to meet with students from our feeder schools. Each year, along with the English department, we organise for an author to visit the school. We find that this really raises the profile and importance of reading across all of our students. Past authors have included Alex Scarrow, James Campbell and Mark Lowry. The Spelling Bee Championships 
is the region's largest inter-school spelling championship and is organised by us. Annually, 17 primary schools come to our school to compete against our Year 17 in spelling words out loud. Not only does it raise the profile of spelling and enhance our spelling knowledge, it provides our great opportunity to work with students from our far outreaching feeder schools too. In addition to all the events in the school calendar that the library organise, they also have a range of student opportunities that you can get involved in. These include becoming a student librarian, where you can help look after the library. We have over 50 student librarians across the years. The Reading Leadership Scheme also provides an opportunity to our Year 10 students to mentor our younger students with their reading choices and confidence. Our library holds a book group with Miss Norman once a week. If you are a book lover, this is a great chance to meet with like-minded people, talk about your thoughts and get book recommendations. We hope this film has given you a good insight into how great our library is at East Burghardt High School. We hope to see you soon.